Hey guys, it's Plusasaurus. I'm bringing you my first single player uh, LCPDFR patrol. I'm using my custom uh, texture pack that I used with my um, my release on LCPDFR. I use it with a few vehicles made from other modelers. I didn't model these vehicles myself, um, but I did make the textures. Um, patrolling in uh, Alderney, so I'll be using my Alderney PD textures. Which is right here. I'm also going to be using the uh, O12 Taurus. I'm not sure who the who made it. I think it was like EVI or someone. But I'll have proper links in the credits and everything like that. So I'm just gonna go 10-8, and uh, this is my first uh, commentary single player LCPFR patrol. So bear with me and uh, go easy on me, guys. So I'm just gonna go ahead and activate some Brave Hearts. I'll also be switching out vehicles too, so I'll probably move on to the Crown Vic after like I do one call with this. Hello. Go ahead and go into first person. Let's go to shoplift. I'm also using uh, Braveheart's policing script, as well as LCPDFR and a few other mods. Go ahead and just go code because it's a quite a ways away. Galveston, Topaz, and uh, Algonquin. I'll be out of jurisdiction, but I'll take a call. Uh, I don't really like these narrow, thin roads. They're bumpy and. Make me lose control quite a few times. Anyways, while I'm spawning, guys, uh, let me know in the comments what you think about the, uh, the texture on this vehicle. What you think of them. Um, this is my Algonquin um, police. Or not, no. Um, Alderney, my bad, correct. Um, this is my Alderney City Police. Um, I'm really proud of it. I liked it. The uh, second skin I've ever made. Oh, I mean, third skin I've ever made, and I really like it, so I'm excited. I've released it on, uh, I think it's like gta4mods.com or something, as well as lcpdfr. Um, so if you guys want to, you know, put a link in the description. And uh, yeah, feel free to use it. If you use it for a clan, make sure you ask me first. Um, usually I'll say yes, I don't mind if you use it in a clan, but. Um, just making sure you ask me. Oh, didn't see that. Now I'm out of jurisdiction now, but it's not too far over, so I'll be fine. This is my uh, Algonquin place. This is where I have Algonquin City Police. I'll, uh, the next video I do, I'll upload that one and I'll use that. But yeah. And then I'll move on to the Broker Dukes one that I have. Oh, I don't know if she's arrested. So I'm just going to leave her here because I don't feel like calling for a transport or transporting her, although the police station is right across the street. But, uh, alright, now. I'm going to go back 10-8. First, I'm going to respawn a Crown Vic. Page 2. This is just the skin that came with the uh, Crown Vic. It's not the one I made. I'll just flip through my libraries real quick. You hear so, here's my Alderney. Then I got Algonquin. Then it's just a generic. Here's my Broker Dukes. I really like this one. I really like this one a lot. Not much on it, just like a side decals and stuff like that, but I really like this stripe. It replicates the Toronto, Canada, please. Hey, let's get out of the car, okay? But uh, I'm going to go back to jurisdiction now. Probably respond to a high priority call. 
I don't really like doing shots fired because pretty much I win every time but but why not yeah crap there's a black bar right there apple white street okay looks like see him out with a weapon down on the beach I go code This is one of my favorite vehicles because of the bumper stickers. The far left one with the white background it says LOL, OMG, RIP, don't text and drive. It's kind of a play on words and stuff like that about how OMG and LOL are text abbreviations and, you know, driving. Whatever, you guys are mature enough to get it. And then the middle one is the, the uh, click it or ticket, basically buckling up your seatbelt. And then the far right one is uh, basically a remembrance of 9-11. So, yeah, I thought it was appropriate to put it on there. Alright, well, it looks like she's got an uh, MP5. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, pull out my shotgun. Try and make contact with the... Ah, oh, crap. Alright, whatever. Makes it more realistic. There we go. I got my shotgun. Well, accidental discharge, but she dropped the weapon, which is good. I didn't have to shoot her. You are under arrest. Once again, I'm just going to leave her. Recover the weapon and just leave her. Because I don't want to drive back. Alright. So I'm going to stay off duty for a little bit, and then now I'm going to go and uh, just do some traffic stops and stuff like that, patrol the streets. And then uh, after that I'll probably take one last call, hopefully a pursuit or something like that. Maybe I can get a pursuit on a traffic stop and then uh, end the video. But uh, yeah, like I said in the beginning, this is my first uh, LCPDFR single player patrol. So go easy on me when you guys are watching it, and because uh, I know uh, comments on YouTube can be quite hateful, so... But, uh, yeah, I'm hoping I can get, um, big, and, uh, I can get a lot of subscribers, because I like doing this, I like patrolling, I like LCPDFR, and, uh, yeah, so, guys, support me if you'd like. And just remember, comment, like, and subscribe. Also, rate. Actually, wait, no, you can't rate. You can thumbs up and recommend it to your friends. I'm trying to get a YouTube partnership so I can do more of these. I'm just a newbie. Not much traffic on the road. Maybe I'm not doing any traffic stops. Just take some brave hearts until maybe I can get uh, more vehicles to spawn. Yeah, sorry for the lag, guys. It's laggy in this area of the map. It'll get better here soon. Also, recording with fraps and stuff like that makes my FPS drop hardcore. So. Well, officer requiring assistance. No, I'm not going to respond there. I want to try and get a vehicular pursuit, maybe even a domestic or something. I want cars to spawn so I can actually pull people over, but... I'll respond to an MBA. Babbage. Alright. Go code, there might be injuries. Go ahead and request that you'll see any of this on scene, so when they get there they might uh might have to get the jaws of life out so I can uh, pry them out of the car. Most of the times going to these 1050s or MBAs, whatever you want to call them, they're usually okay. They're just in their car and they can't drive, so I'll probably just wind up getting here and having to push them off the road. Yeah, the siren I'm using is the, uh, I think it's like Touchmaster Delta Federal Signal or something like that. I'm not too sure. Um, I'll try and find it and possibly put a link in the description. But, 
I really like it. Really cool. Well, how did they get me out of it? Oh, okay. Well, it looks like one's dead. I'm gonna have to get him out. got EMS on route. I'm doing CPR on this guy. He's uh, he's DOA. Hopefully I can revive him. When EMTs get here, if they ever get here, they'll probably be able to revive him. Now he's dead. This guy seems okay. This guy might be the problem. Looks like this guy came in while this guy was coming out. They just collided. I'm gonna go ahead and clear scene now. Not much I can do anymore. Uh, EMS and fire will probably get on scene here soon. And then uh, they'll go ahead and get the body and clear the scene and all that stuff. But uh, I'm gonna go 10 8 now. Traffic spawning, so I'll probably do some uh, traffic stops. I'm gonna stop this guy because time is it. Yeah, it's kind of early morning. Can't really see much. Lights are on, so I'm gonna stop him for not having his lights on. Side of the road, stupid. Go ahead and stop him. Hi. Looks like he's compliant for now. We'll see uh, you want a ticket for being he has any an wants or warrants when I run him. Reach for your ID. Slowly. Much appreciated. Anyways guys, if you've watched this whole episode, this will probably be day one. Um, I don't know what I'm going to name it. I'll probably just do day one. Uh, like as a rookie or something like that. I don't know. I'll figure something out. But uh. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Um, like I said, I'll be releasing more. I'm going to make this a habit. Maybe even do one once a day or something and uh, upload it. But uh, I really hope you guys enjoy this upcoming series. Oh crap. And I uh, hope you keep watching me. Like I said, I'm uh, trying to go for uh, subscribers because uh, I'm like going for a uh, big time texture artist and uh, I'm hoping to make it big and subscribers are going to really help me if I can get some so yeah guys remember to subscribe I'll upload other videos other than this I'll upload my texture previews and stuff like that and uh, you know, I'll give you guys a sneak peek so I'm just going to go ahead and let this guy off the warning and uh, I'm going to go 107 back to the station and uh, I'm going to cut it there so as I go there, just a little bit about myself. I'm from Arizona and I'm 16. Um, I really like texturing. I can't model, but hopefully I can uh, learn that here soon. Maybe even start modeling for people. Um, I'm an amateur modeler. I'm not really known, but like I said a couple times, um, trying to get subscribers so I can get known. And uh, hopefully you guys can support me. I'd be really appreciated. Um, this is my uh, Call of Duty City pack. I have a couple more textures up on LCPFR. For instance, one of my uh, Sheriff's Office vehicles. Um, I really like that. It uh, it works. It was my second skin for six months. And the first skin I ever made was a Hillsborough County replica. And uh, I did a pack for that with a couple few vehicles for my old clan pack. So I just decided to release them. And... Uh, yeah, now I'm here. Ah, oh, here comes the lag in this area. It's always this one area. I don't know why or what's so. how. No. Well, sorry guys. I wanted to go to the station, but my computer decided to run too slowly. It usually doesn't do this, but uh, it's just in that one area. So, 
I'm Pussasaurus, and uh, hopefully you guys watch my more videos. Remember, comment, like, rate, and subscribe. Check out my LCPR page at Pussasaurus. And I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one, guys.